back up on this street. I have inside foot position. Top wrist is going to step up the foot. I'm going to connect shins, get a snake grip on the back of the knee, and I'm just going to look to take this foot off the ground. So I'm going to make, just use body If I just fall this way, it just moves it. Okay, I'm not using too much pressure. He's going to grab my head and pressure inward. Yeah, so really, okay, notice how this hook slides down the knee. This one does kind of a U, a U shape to get to my ass. Push him away, pull him back in, kick the ankle. One way he can prevent himself from falling is just by distributing all of his weight forward. So I go for this, and then he puts his hands on the mat, and yeah, he puts all of his weight forward. So now he's just kind of, he's just kind of hanging out here, and I have doubling, I have control of both ankles. Okay, with him right here, I'm going to switch to, I'm going to pass off this far ankle to my near hand like so. Now my bottom hook is going to shoot through. I'm going to get to my cross option position. So today we're learning a rimyashi, she goes shin to shin into a rimyashi, right? So he stacks up on me and um, I've done this move a few times live before, but uh, I, I grab the leg, I can go for the sweep. The one thing I don't, I go into reverse X, I forget to cut that leg off and I go straight into a Texas Cloverleaf. But at this point too, um, uh, this is the first time I have actually done done um, Achilles lock as well, so that's pretty cool. He's he's like tapping and he's like, damn that hurt. All right, so I butt scoot in, and I shoot into Rimiashi right here. So right now we're just like drilling. Um, so I think that's important for jujitsu, man. Like a lot of people, like they always roll, 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 right? And uh, this one, I don't know why. I think that I'm working on actually my bad side. So. Like in jujitsu, we all have good sides and bad sides. I literally get stuck. I was like, what the fuck? I, I can't figure this shit out, right? So then um, uh, my boy Patrick over there, like you can see him in the back pointing at people and instructing them. He was like, you got to move your foot and stuff. So I'm like literally struggling. So I'm trying to reverse back into X guard and stuff like that and try to figure that out. Um, yeah, but this is jujitsu it's really learning how to like how to move around and use your body man so it's it's pretty tough stuff man so um i don't i'm not really much of a oh shit i, I just got it and going to texas clover relief i was like fuck yeah but i was like i don't know how i got into it so alex let's do this freaking again i think it's kind of hard on alex too because he has like really really short legs man and it's like sometimes tough so i go in here um i screw up if you see my like what it's my right leg i i should be framing it yeah so i just adjusted that i should be framing against his hip right there and uh i really need to keep that frame and then sh take that leg out uh, i fucked up i should have taken the leg out and then triangle it right over there and then pulling on this side i don't know why this time i didn't really do it i forgot to also pass the leg like Patrick told us to, but you know, whatever. I'm a I'm a white belt, Wakanda forever white belt, brah. And so Alex, his turn. He's a lot. He's this is his game. Like he's an Ashi player. Uh, literally, bam. We're we're. I don't remember if this is good side or bad side, but literally he gets it. Bop bop, bop bop, and he just needs to triangle it, and then he got. He basically has it done, and I. Uh, he basically tries to step out but one of the things that he was doing was like flaring his knee out so i can peel that so the tighter, tighter you keep it the better you can see the 10 planet guys like being yo what's up shaka 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 hawaii baby all right all right let's line up So this is the part you guys have all been waiting for. Literally, the black belt calls me out. I try to shoot for a rolling Kimura. He blocks me with the hip. <laughs> Bro, I, I'm laughing. Well, well, I'm doing that cheese, uh, cheese move that actually Patrick taught me how to do that. Patrick is doing a really great job at, um, at his frames and controlling my elbows. He has that really strong like collar tie and he's trying to get his elbows, uh, his uh, legs above my 
my shoulders and stuff like that he plays a really high guard and so for y'all that don't know um patrick he's going super super easy i mean he's not even trying he's like telling me like yo i try i was trying to submit you in less than like two minutes anybody black belt white belt don't matter and um he actually competed in i believe ebi and on it invitation invitational so yeah he knows his shit he's a he's really 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 good um yeah and like literally uh what's happening now he's playing a lot of close guard game i'm literally if you can see i'm moving right because i'm trying to follow his hips the whole time and he actually has a really strong frame against my head and that's pulling me down and keeping me from posturing i actually have a really shitty base at this point because if you can tell my my uh, left knee is actually really in and keep in mind i'm no black belt i'm not a commentator i'm just like a regular fucking white belt bro so he keeps on pulling my pulling my neck down he's controlling my arm controlling my arm i'm like oh shit he's gonna lock up the triangle so i'm i literally have a two on one on uh on his leg at this point you can kind of see it so i'm just like preventing the triangle because that's how i'm gonna get taps right so pretty interesting and uh it's this battle right it's this battle like this battle constant battle he lets go of it we're back in guard and sometimes that's jujitsu man like sometimes like you guys fight for such a strong position you keep on fighting 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 but you just don't get the position that you want so yeah um break at this point uh i, I try to shoot over and do a fly like i don't know what they call it fly chick or something like that um he's inverting 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 uh he's inverting inverting uh oh shit i got swept so i'm trying to use his arimi ashi stuff that uh he taught us earlier in class but he's like literally stuffing my leg and i i honestly like when it comes to open guard like this i don't think that far right and so immediately he gets side control and at this point i'm just framing uh and i forgot to <laughs> <laughs> i'm a rookie white belt bro I, I i let him pass my guard and he literally takes uh takes the top right and um i think people don't realize like dude when you go against a black belt they can choke you at will so patrick is really like there's no way patrick is like competing trying to kick my ass and kill me dude he's being so easy on me i'm trying to frame 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 he switches he switches into side control i'm posting um, or I'm framing against his hip. Uh, I try ghost out and he ends up in a different like side control. Um, he has like a try and shoot for a twister, but twister side control. And I'm literally just framing against his hip or his shoulder and stuff. And I'm trying to, uh, not, I'm trying not to reach over with my far leg. I go into turtle position. He has a Kimura grip and he literally takes my back at this point. So he takes my back and I'm like struggling here. And uh, it's it's basically has double underhooks. So he has really, really, it's not really good. Like from what my other coaches told me, like it's not a really good offensive position, but it's a really good um, control position, right? And at this point, right, it's just like, we're just ham fighting, right? And I'm just trying to block, block like where he's trying to get the choke and I'm trying not to let him. So. Like a lot of things that I noticed Patrick does, he tries to kind of drill like what he's going to teach the next day. Uh, Patrick, like I'm trying to beat his head to the mat. Um, because when you're in this position, like what you want to do is get your sh um, head to the mat and get your shoulders to the mat and just drive out that way, right? So like at this point, uh, he ha he's like controlling my arms, he's trapping it. I'm like, oh, fuck, what do I do? He gets a body triangle in it. I'm like, oh, shit. And if he, and one interesting thing he does, he does a body triangle on the inside rather than the outside because sometimes you can you can catch the body triangle and uh, you can fuck somebody's uh, ankles up with that. I try to go for that. I'm a cheese, I'm a cheese, cheese guy, man. Like, oh, this sucks. And if you ever been in this position, it's just like, dude, it's like, oh, man. And he's like... I'm like, oh, let's not get triangled. He's trying to go for a reverse triangle right now. Like, you know, have you ever seen Black Panther, Wakanda Forever? Like, 
uh he he's trying to go for that reverse tri- he was trying to go for that reverse triangle where he, um uh t'challa like chokes out mbaku so yeah so this is the this is the part man he's try he's really trying for that or not trying for that but he has like a um ugh, i forget what it's called I, i'm a fu- i'm such a fucking white belt bro like <laughs> I'm like at this point I'm not even trying to win I'm like trying not to get killed this is how you like when and I think that's important too like when when you're going against a black belt like I'm not oh man I, I just choke out I'm just like oh fuck me fuck me so yeah that was good round one all right so we're going round two I shoot for butterfly guard and he's trying to flatten me out and i was like oh shit it's, i'm like 45 degrees and a lot of time if you stay in this position you're going to get crushed right uh <laughs> shimagesi or oh, fuck i don't know what that reverse like butterfly hook thing is called but i'm like literally trying to get my get the underhook on his right side but he mounts me so he passes my knee line uh, he's trying to go for that reverse triangle, I think, again, or maybe an arm bar or something. Yeah, he goes for an arm bar. I'm like, fuck me. Like, <laughs> oh, again, I'm, I'm like trying hard. He has me, and um, oh man, why am I blanking out today? I'm just like really slow, and I tap again. He gets me in the arm bar. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I actually don't remember that submission. It's pretty funny, but yeah um and he does two on one and this is literally shit that he does in class i'm trying he he uh he's trying to go for a heel hook maybe i think uh let's see let's see what he's trying to do oh he's trying to do the same thing in class and literally this is what he's doing he's like literally breaking step by step uh he's he is trying to collect my legs and get me you see me smiling too that is so funny i'm just like oh shit like shit 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 fight he he literally just taught us the fence for a little bit i was like i don't remember this i don't remember this i was like oh fuck it <laughs> i'm like laughing so hard man uh good times with patrick good times with patrick man so on this day, this was my only live, that was my only live role with Patrick, the black belt. So right now we're just like going over different things. Uh, I'm trying to practice what Patrick taught us like uh, like two weeks ago. Roll into truck uh, from, from um, turtle position, right? And then go into the baseball bat control and set up the twister. If you watch UFC, a Korean zombie actually hit this... Uh, hit this submission which was pretty cool so yeah but but yeah I'm, i've been really working this by the way and notice like i'm not i don't have the lockdown anymore i have the uh the lotus like uh uh indian style or lotus uh legs just because sometimes when you keep the lockdown and you're in that position like people can with that free leg that you see that alex has they can scoop it inside and that time i didn't do lotus right i need to make sure i do a lotus position and i've been really loving the swedish final three man like that is that is sick and the final three is like the process of nailing the twister if you've never been thrown in a twister it feels like really shitty <laughs> like we have this uh, apparently there's like this rule of people like you know if you get thrown in a twister you owe them a burrito or a hamburger or some shit like that so let but so just waiting just waiting indian style indian style and it's really uncomfortable right but uh i'm like really trying to crank on that crank get that tight take the slack out pull that over hook that and literally it doesn't really take that much to just just crank their head like that so i'm like bam he's like oh fucking hate this shit so uh, being a good partner he wants to drill this uh z guard type of thing where you flip over and take the back like that that time didn't exactly work out so we keep on working it working it working it but that's part of about being a good partner too is like making sure that um they're expanding their game you're expanding your game right so but z guard push that out go into the back take pretty sick that time was pretty good and now um 
I'm just really working. So if you saw my last video, I was shooting for Iminaris and stuff. So basically, I'm just looking for different setups. I play Reverse Deal. I don't really play Reverse De La Hiva that much. So I've been trying to work that a little more, sit on my ass cheek and try to get a tighter bite. Um, so I'm, I'm like, okay, um, just working the motions, right? So I don't really go for this. Uh, but I'm trying to go for a sweep and then I can spiral under, go for the, the crab ride and stuff like that. Bam, bam, seatbelt control, back take, right? So that's one entry, right? So I'm, so what I'm like trying to figure out at this point is trying to hit the Iminari from that. So if all else fails, then I can go for the Iminari on the far leg, right? So, but, okay. So reverse De La Hiva and we're talking and uh alex is leading me and i'm trying to shoot for the minari and uh i fucked up that's the outside yeah i fucked up i mean it still works but like dude i want the minari so it's like i think this is the why drilling is so important like in jujitsu it's just because like honestly um, you get to slow things down and just work at your own pace, right? And just get in your reps because the only difference between hitting a move and not hitting a move is just having the reps in, right? So the reason why I was able to hit the Minari on Alex, <laughs> even though I had tricked him, it's like, bam. So I'm like, okay, I've been in this position before. So all I need to do is collect the leg, blah, blah, blah. Kind of, kind of, kind of weak, bro. But at least I'm getting the movement down and I keep on drilling it. And you're seeing like... I hope you see this like every single time I do this I get a little a little better each time you know so again um, try and go for for the sweep my my legs are too short so I can't sweep them so then I try to go spiral I don't know what we're doing we're talking we're talking I'm pointing at him Alex is b way better at this than me right go out i'm like what the heck am i doing right like why would i go out like it doesn't make sense i'm like okay this is like go 6k oh okay starting to understand it okay a little bit better this time and it gets a little bit better every time right so alex goes he's so much better than me at this man it's it's not even funny bam bam goes to a tripod i want to get better like this right he's really good at this and yeah, and uh, he has this cool thing where he grabs, he actually grabs that far side, yeah, the other leg and just throws me into um, into that move, man. Pretty cool. Now, uh, I, don't, I was trying to make another meme, but it's hella funny. So this is something I, I like to do a lot. Bam, go into truck. I really been loving truck a lot. So, and look at that face, man. I'm just staring right back at the ca uh, camera. But if you like this, let me know, and uh, I'll keep on doing more of these videos. Whew. Got back from training today. Pretty fun day. A lot of drilling. Uh, as you can see, I rolled against a black belt. <laughs> My boy Patrick ended up submitting me, but uh, did okay. You know, like, proud of myself. I'm also a lot bigger than Patrick, I think. I think he's like 180, I'm 191 at the time of this recording. So, yeah, I think I uh, did okay. And, um, yeah, man, I just want to get better and better and better. So, yeah, hope you guys like this series. And I'll talk to you soon. Peace.